respond and uh, perhaps to interact uh, to a certain extent. Yes. So, who wants to answer? Yeah. First of all, uh, uh, I, I want to say something about the, uh, the numbers uh, our moderator just mentioned, uh, and also mentioned by uh, Dr. Oreskes, uh, about small percentages. How has uh, Green Lake County uh, 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 statistics? Well, uh, the numbers are small for uh, three major reasons. The first is that uh, uh, it's not a comprehensive list, uh, as I said in the, in the beginning. Uh, it, it, it's the same thing in uh, all other countries, too. I mean, you, you build up the database gradually, so you add more items over time. And secondly, uh, Taiwan, in terms of resources depletion, uh, as I said, the only two, uh, the, the only items included are the groundwater and the gravel, basically. <laughs> so, uh, uh, Taiwan uses a lot of resources from overseas. <laughs> so, uh, well, this is a very uh, is a place where resources are very scarce. So, uh, so, uh, uh, but you know, in terms of uh, green, uh, I mean, it, it grows domestic product. Uh, all the f resources we import uh, doesn't count. Okay, so it's so, domestic. So, do you think those numbers would be larger in the United States or Australia? Yes, 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 yes. Yeah. So, for example, we, we import uh, more than 90% of our energy. Okay. So, it uses up resources uh, elsewhere in the world. Okay. So, that's the second reason. And the third reason is exactly what I just said uh, in my presentation. We also adopt the SAIA system, which treats green GDP as the avoidance cost or the abatement cost. Okay. So we, you really have a point. Well, the low number simply says the cost of abatement is that not that alarming. In other words, it's bearable by our GDP. Okay. But many people think in Taiwan we have serious problems with the environment, where I think you're uh, you, you mean damages, okay, health damages or uh, uh, unpleasant uh, journeys to the countryside, okay, as a result of pollution and so on and so forth. And that is, that should be the ideal way to calculate green GDP. But I just, as, as I said, the United Nations adopts, say, a system which does not uh, calculate all these damages, although they should be, <laughs> so, uh, but also because it's harder to calculate accurately the damages. Okay. Uh, so, uh, uh, so that, that tells the discrepancy between uh, what some people can feel and uh, what the numbers tell them. Okay. That, that's the first thing I would say. Uh, the second thing I want to say is that the uh, 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 giving a value, a dollar sign to a concept, uh, can be seen as an obscene to obscene thing to do. <laughs> uh, people will say it's immoral, okay, because uh, it should be valued. I mean, it should it should have a Infinite value, okay, because it, it, it's the principle, okay. Well, that that's true too, yeah. But if we have two campaigns, and both insist on the principles, then, I mean, it's just like uh, differences in religious belief. I mean, that's.
that's the end. <laughs> okay, because I have my belief and you have your belief, so we fight all the way along the way. And, and there's no solution, okay, because it's either zero or one. Okay. Uh, number, I think, is important because in spite of the allegations that we have uh, all these uh, uh, strong fundamental beliefs, uh, the real world has to make a decision, and most decisions are based on numbers. Okay. To remove the damage from the environment costs money. <laughs> that means budget, or things we take from our purse, and that's numbers. Okay. Uh, Damages can be monetized, and so can the, the cost of abatement. So I think we should have all the numbers ready. We, of course, can argue that some numbers are more accurate uh, than the others, and we can prove on the calculation or the imputation numbers. Uh, but I think we need numbers to make decisions. So. Having the numbers, I think, is the first step in trying to reach a solution. And finally, on, on green economy, uh, I heard the term many times before, okay? In Taiwan? Uh, or in uh, other in, else? In, in the literature, okay. Uh, I think it means different things to different people. <laughs> and it has been used in different ways in different uh, countries or economies. But I think basically the idea is that we should have an economy that is more balanced. Okay. It's, it's, it's because we used to have economies which are uh, basically uh, too friendly to the uh, industry, uh, treating pollution or carbon emission as if they're free goods. Okay. So green economy brings the balance into the picture by saying we should uh, give uh, ways to both sides. Now, on that remark, uh, you mentioned the PRC, okay. Uh, the, the, they have a 12, 5-year plan, okay. I mean, it was announced uh, last year. Now, the, that plan uh, differs from all the previous plans in its uh, emphasis on environmental protection. I think they too realize that they have not only become the factory of the world, but also become the dumping sites of the world. <laughs> okay. So uh, they're trying to do that uh, in, in, the, in that direction. Uh, and about green accounting, it's very interesting. Uh, they almost uh, use green GDP as their official national uh, development target <laughs> in the 12 uh, five year plan, almost. Uh, but it's, it was aborted in the last minute because uh, you know, they have uh, different factions fighting with each other. And the, uh, the head of the statistic department, uh, who was uh, uh, advocating this, uh, somehow lost power in the power struggle. <laughs> so uh, in the end, we see only the, uh, the national goal of uh, GDP growth in, in, uh, in de defining in, in, a, in, in the traditional way. Yeah, but. Uh, my point is that uh, uh, green accounting, uh, if all the uh, uh, methodologies are become more mature, I think it has the potential to be adopted as the correct national goals for all the countries in the world. I hope that one day we'll realize. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I'd just like to add a little bit about the question of numbers and also answer your question. So 